Good morning, guys. Good morning. And I am so glad that you are here with me on today. Well, listen, guys, on this Mind Your Mentality Monday, I just want to let you know this, that people want to keep you on the swerve. They want to keep you on the swerve or in this curve in your life. They want to keep playing mind games with you. They want to keep messing with your money. They want to keep messing with your heart. They want to keep messing with your peace. But I heard God say this, that he wants you to get out of the swerve. See, when you're driving in traffic, you have what you call exits that you can get off at on the interstate if you're in the interstate. And you 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 turn this curve. And I remember as a young driver, even in my neighborhood, when I hit a curve, I hit this swerve, I almost lost control of the car. It hit like a stop sign or a mailbox. See, your enemy wants to position himself through people in your life to get you on this swerve, to get you in this curve, to get you in a learning curve where you done got the lesson, but because you keep letting that person into your life, because you keep letting that old mindset control your habits, because you keep letting that old dark energies into your space, you stay in a swerve, you stay in a curve, you stay bent over, you stay sick, you stay sad, you stay confused, you stay depressed. And God is saying, I want you to come out of the swerve. I want you to learn what you were supposed to in this curve because I want to make your crooked path straight. I want to take your mind and position it to where it is total aligned with who I am. I want to position your thoughts on things above in the 5D dimension. God is saying that you are a spiritual being, that you are a chosen one. You're quite a bit different from average people. He's saying that he wants you to get familiar with the unseen. See, a lot of you are getting caught up in the swerve on this curve because you're looking at what's passing you by. You're getting caught up on the swerve on this curve because you're looking at what you lost. You're getting caught up on the swerve on this curve because you're looking at everybody else have this and everybody else having that. You're getting caught up on the swerve on this curve because you're not keeping your mind steadfast on him, on the higher frequency, on love, on joy, on peace, on long suffering, on abundance, on wealth, on success, on good health. No matter what shows up in this 3D dimension right here, I'm 5D, baby. I don't care what shows up in 3D. I'm 5D, which means that I am a faith walker. That means that I walk on water. That means that I call things into my life that ain't because I know that it already exists because I had it before I got here. I'm here for people who want to have a radical life. I'm here for people who want to come up out of this swerve up out of this curve i'm here to wake you up to let you know to get familiar with touching what you can't see get familiar for knowing with knowing that it does exist get familiar with pulling things into this dimension with your mind because god is saying on this mind your mentality monday i want you to get out of the swerve i want you to get out of this learning curve you've been here for 10 years you've been here for 15 years i need for you to get out of the swerve of old habits i need for you to get out of the swerve of self medicating with alcohol and drugs and people. I want you to get out of the swerve and into my alignment, out of the swerve and into my heart. I heard God said, just line up with me. Let that go. Stop trying to do what everybody else is doing. Just let that go. And on this mind, your mentality, Monday, your enemy is in your life to keep your mind occupied with foolishness, lower activities, lower spiritual things, lower frequencies. God is saying, you've got the learning curve. You've mastered it already. Get off a of heartbreak boulevard. Get out of Broke Avenue. Get off of Health Crisis Boulevard. Get out of sick road and get on this road. Come out of the swerve. Come out of the swerve and get aligned with me. Stop looking at what you're seeing. It's a manifestation of an old thought pattern. I need for you to get familiar 
with what you don't see because eventually you're going to transition to what you can see. God said, I want you to see it before you see it or you never will see it. God has said, I want you to live it before you live it or you never will live it. God is saying that I created you to create. I chose you to change the game. God is saying, get into this flow. Get into it. God is saying, get into this flow. Get off of this swerve. Get off of this curve and get in to this flow until the next video guys mm -hmm. peace because i still believe in you bye now